Hello, this is William Hemphill, pastor, therapist, and host of the Faith and Family Matters podcast. I want to talk to you today for a couple minutes from the subject, This Little Light of Mine. There is a song that goes, This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. The second verse of it actually says, everywhere I go, I'm going to let it shine. Are we allowing our light to shine today? Now, I wanted to share from this thought because I had just finished attending a conference where we were encouraged to let our lights shine. We were encouraged to share our gifts, talents, abilities to the world that we live in. And I specified to the world that we live in because I mean our circle of influence, our family, our friends, our churches. I don't know if you're doing social media, your YouTube channels, podcasts, wherever it may be, and whatever our gifts, talents, and abilities are, we are to share them to the world. Now, I do know that many people do this, but oftentimes we don't do it fully, myself included. And so I thought about a challenge that many of us face in sharing our light to the world or with the world. <clears throat> and that challenge is people that want to snuff it out. People who want to snuff our light out. And... <clears throat> I would say there are two kinds of people in that. The first one naturally is others. They are critics. They might be close relationships who don't believe in you or your work. It might be someone who's known you from long ago that used to put you down and criticize you and say you weren't worth anything. It might be especially if you're online, those who want to write comments on your videos or your podcasts or different things like that, criticizing your work, or in a lot of cases, sometimes just insulting you. Those are people who want to put your light out. Because if they put your light out, they keep you from blessing other people. And we don't want that to happen. So I wanted us to know about the first type of critic is of other people, those who want to criticize you or put your light out. But here is the second person who might want to snuff your light out. And this one is more critical and more important. That person is you. That person is me. What do I mean by that? That internal voice inside of us, that voice of doubt, can try to snuff our light out. It's that voice that says that we aren't capable of living our dreams or walking in our purpose. It's that voice that tells us that we aren't good enough to help others. It's that voice that says that I have messed up in my past, so I have no authority to talk about anything in the present. It's that inner critic that wants to snuff our light out. I want to submit to you that in either case, whether it's the criticism of others or our own internal critics, that's nothing but the voice of the enemy trying to keep us from living out God's purpose in our lives. So my encouragement for us today is let our light shine. Let the goodness 
grace and gifting that God has placed in us flow out of us and begin to touch others. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine.